Welcome to Masters of the Lawn. On today's video, I'm going to show you the results of the soil test we did on my lawn and my brother's lawn. Guys, I am so excited. We finally got the results so we can finally start working on this lawn. Yes. I was very surprised when I saw my results. That pH is through the roof. It's way too high. So we're gonna put some sulfur down and lower that pH. This test is from a different website than my brother's test. It's from soilkit.com. So let's do mine first, of course. I got a very, very high pH. So I got 8.2, which is very alkaline. You know, no bueno, not good. It also says phosphorus is medium. My potassium is very high. Manganese and calcium are very high, and that's probably has to do, that probably has to do with the pH itself. Once we bring that pH down, I know those are gonna normalize. Now let's look at my brother's results. This is a different test. I think I like this one a little bit more. This is the soil test we did on my previous video. Go check that out in my description. I'll link it down below. Okay, nitrogen optimal. His phosphorus, optimal. Now look at his potassium. Low, very low. His pH is also high and his calcium as well. There's barely any iron, which is why his lawn is it's got this lime green color. It's lacking on, on that deep green. His manganese is very low. His zinc is non-existent. See, so micronutrients are really, really low. I like this chart, you know, because it tells you what are the macronutrients and the micronutrients. What we're gonna do is, we're gonna throw down some real good fertilizer. We'll do an application of murate of potash. Probably on a different video, but first, Override, Captain Lon Murica.
for those of you that don't know, I still have some ryegrass here in my turf. This ryegrass is proving that it's very, very hard to kill. All right, so this is how my lawn looks right now. It looks very scalp because it rains so much. So you can see some sculpting marks. That was me last night. I couldn't stand it anymore. It was way too tall. So I went to town with it. And today we lower it even more. I am hoping that that is not fungus. However, we're gonna treat for fungus regardless. All right, it's time to raise that pH and put down some nutrients. Let's go. We're finally going to kickstart these lawns with all these products and we're gonna see a huge boost on these Bermuda lawns in the next couple of weeks. You can put all these products in your lawn but also you need to put some love on it. If not, it's not gonna work. Now I need you to hit that like button, subscribe and that, hit that notification bell as well. This is Captain Lawn America with Masters of the Lawn. Goodbye. <laughs>